Do not attempt to decock your crossbow using your Charger EXT crank without the included fail-safe strap installed. Serious injury or product damage could result. Start by removing the crank handle, pressing the release lever, and pull straight out of the socket. Removing the handle avoids it from swinging around when trying to position the hooks on the string. Push release catch switch forward into the release position, allowing the two hooks to pull away from the crank. Run the crank rope around the string groove located on the stock under the safety and down onto the string. Confirm both hooks are tight against the mainframe. If the hooks are jumping on top of the mainframe when cranking, you have not braced the rope through the string groove located under the safety. The hooks can damage the side of the mainframe if the rope is not positioned correctly. Damage caused by incorrect use of the caulking aid is not covered under warranty. Confirm there is no arrow loaded. Not doing so could result in serious injury. Insert crank handle into fail-safe strap and secure strap on wrist. Install crank handle into the Charger EXT handle socket. There will be an audible click when engaged. Keeping a firm grip on the crank handle, move safety up into the fire position. With slight forward pressure, depress the ADF override and squeeze the trigger. Full draw weight will be transferred to the crank. Slowly crank in a counterclockwise direction until the string reaches brace height and there is no further pressure on the handle. Removing the crank handle, pressing the release lever, and pull straight out of the socket. Removing the handle avoids it from swinging around. Then remove both crank hooks from the crossbow string and hold them and allow the retraction spring to draw the rope back into the crank automatically. Store the crank hooks on the two front keeper posts. Remove the Charger EXT crank by pulling the locking button out, located on the left side. Slide the Charger EXT out of the bracket. 